Good morning, YouTube family. Welcome back or welcome to Lin Lin. Thank you guys so much for coming to check out the video today. I am at a food bank doing another food bank grocery haul. Now, if you have never seen my first food bank grocery haul, I'll call it a grocery haul because I got a bunch of stuff from a food bank. Now, I live in a state, Oregon to be exact, where they provide a lot, a lot of resources for people that live in this state. There's a bunch of community resources, there's a bunch of food banks, there's a bunch of things like that where people are able to come when they're in need and get food from these food banks. Now the food bank that I'm at today is the same one that I went to the first time I did a food bank um, video, which is called PAX. And this is here in Portland. Um, you don't need to live in a specific area to be able to receive food from them, I don't think and you're able to come here at least once a month. It could be once or twice, I'm not sure. I usually come sometimes once a month, sometimes I don't come at all. There's been months where I didn't come for a consecutive amount of months. Um, I did come about a month ago, maybe a month and a half. It's been probably about a month and a half ago. Here we are, it's the end of March. I'm back at the food bank just to see what they have, what I can get to last me through the end of the month up until next month. So guys, I'm here and I'm gonna see what they have. There's a bunch of cars out here right now. Um, I wanna say the line is not as bad as it was the last time I came here. The last time the line was all the way out to the street, like almost in the street. Today when I pulled up, it was a little bit better. The line was just like right at the end of the gate. But I got here at nine, about 9.20 this morning. Um, I wanna say the last time I came, it was a little bit later than that, I'm not sure. But this one is open from 9 to 11. So I try to get here between 9 and 10 or, you know, whenever I can, just so that, you know, I can get through here and get some good stuff before they shut down or before everything's gone. I've never been in a situation where I've gotten here and everything was gone, but you kind of just never know. The way it works here is they come to your car, they give you a ticket. Well, they take your information first, your name, and I want to say it's just the city that you live in and your zip code, and then they give you a ticket. I want to say it's pretty much almost like one box per person, something like that. The last time I only got four boxes though, which is not bad because I did get a lot of stuff in those four boxes, but then I also got a couple bags as well. So I want to say I'm not too sure how they determine how much they give you, but I do know that they do give boxes full of things. So in my last grocery haul, uh, food bank grocery haul, I did get some backlash and people were saying like, why don't you get a job? Why are you going to a food bank? Why are you, why do you have a new car and you're going to a food bank? I just had a bunch of comments like that. And you know, at first, because it was the first video that I had did like that, I was like, you know, I, I did kind of feel some kind of way like, dang, these people, they don't understand the situation. You know, people are so quick to judge without understanding your situation in full. Like, you know, yes, you can have a job. Yes, you can have a new car, but at some point, you know, some sometimes you need a little extra help. So I am grateful to have a food bank um, that I can go to. I'm grateful to live in a state where I can go to a food bank. It doesn't matter if you have a car. It doesn't matter if you have a job. Everybody needs help at some point in time. So for the people that were like in my comments, giving negative comments saying, oh, you shouldn't be doing this. You shouldn't be doing that. When I do food bank hauls or I do things like this, I'm just showing people, you know, my life. I'm showing you what I do for my family. So, you know, you just never know. What I'm gonna do is, um, I explained it in my last video. What they do is they bring boxes to your car. They just load them up. You don't know what's in them. Um, I usually don't go through the boxes until I get home to see what's in them. So that's what I'm gonna do again. I'm gonna load everything up, let them load everything up. And then when I get home, I will resume the video and show you guys everything that I have. What I do with the items that I do not want or I do not have use for. I don't just throw them away, I give them to someone else in need. I give them to my neighbor, I give them to whoever, you know, if I feel like I have things that people would benefit for, um, for having at work, I will take them to work. If I have extra bread or anything like that that I know I'm not gonna use, I take it to work, I give it to a neighbor. So I'm not just throwing away things that I don't need or I don't want. It's okay to not want some stuff. All right, guys, so 
With that being said, when I get home, I will take out the boxes and show you guys everything that I got in this food bank grocery haul. Okay, I am back at home. These are the four boxes that I got from the food bank today. I can already see there's some bread, some eggs, some fruit. I'm about to go through these boxes and pull out everything that's in them and show you guys everything that I got. All right? Okay, I have everything out of the boxes. I'm gonna show you everything that I have. There's a view from down here. First off, these are little laundry detergent sheets. These are biodegradable by Earth Breeze. There's four of these. I got a couple things of vegetable oil here. These are some vegetables, seven in one mixed vegetables. Got a couple cans of ravioli couple cans of tomato sauce. These are little cakes. This is a caramel cheesecake. Couple cupcakes right there. This is another cupcake. Got two things of Peter Pan, honey roast creamy, all natural uh, peanut butter. Some pinto beans, taco seasoning, chicken gravy. Got some pears right here. These are kind of dinged up, but they can be useful for like juices. Got some of these cold brew coffees, Stumptown with oat milk and horchata. Couple things of whipping cream. This right here is an apple green, this is a kiwi apple green drink. Um, this is like made with banana, apple, pineapple, and zucchini. Couple penne pastas. 
Got a bunch of bread back here. Hamburger buns. There's some, yes, buddy. I see. Got a couple things of eggs, some carrots. This is lamb. This right here is uh, some, what is this? This is beef for stew. There's grilled chicken strips as well as sliced and cooked chicken is what that is. I think it's just pretty much the same, just smaller pieces. Bunch of cottage cheese. There's a couple yogurts. Got two bags of the mandarin oranges. My kids love those oranges, so I'm glad I got those. Got two bags of those. Got a couple bags of radishes, a cabbage, some zucchinis. These are leeks, I believe, right here. There's a bag of baby spring mix salad. There's four cases of blueberries. I hope these blueberries are good. These are organic blueberries. We got four of those. Got a bunch of onions, a couple lemons, a couple limes, and there's two bags of potatoes. And then these right here are just sliced potatoes. So guys, this is my food bank grocery haul. Now it's not as big as the last one that I had, but I am grateful for whatever I can get. And this is it guys, that is the end of the video and I will see you guys in the next one. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye.